Welcome to MLAP online class. All right, let's consider this uh, question. And it says evaluate the limit as x approaches 0 of open bracket the square root of uh, 1 plus x minus the square root of 1 minus x all over x close bracket. Now looking at this, if you are to plug in the value of x into the following expression or function rather, you get to have, here you have a 0, which will give us, here we now have a, the square root of 1, then minus the square root of 1 here, all over 0, and this will give us uh, 1 minus 1, all over 0, which will give us what, 0 over what? 0. <coughs> so it implies here that we need to uh, break down this these terms into the simplest term. All right, first, what we just need to do here now is let us multiply the numerator and the denominator of this function by the conjugate of the numerator. Okay, now let's start with that. So here we have the square root of one plus x minus the square root of one minus x all over x, then times now the square root of 1 plus x then plus square root of 1 minus x all over the square root of 1 plus x plus square root of 1 minus x. Okay. Now what we have here is the conjugate of uh, what we have on the right hand side. Okay. Alright. So I just assume... That is the right, uh, right hand side, the left hand side. Sorry, the left hand side. Now, when we tend to multiply through here, then we have this. Now, this one multiplied by this. Here we have 1 plus x. Okay. Now, when this is being multiplied by this, so we have. Uh, let me see here. One plus x into one minus x. Okay. Now the same thing as we we'll multiply this, we have minus. Then at a point we tend to okay, we have the same term here. One plus x into one minus x. And when we multiply this by this, we have negative uh, into 1 minus x. Then all over x now into 1 plus x plus, sorry, 1 minus x okay okay so having done this here so we can see that with this we eliminate this so we are left with 1 plus x then so this minus tend to affect what's in bracket here you have minus 1 plus x all over x into 1 plus x plus 1 minus x okay then the numerator will now give us when we call it like term you can see that this one will eliminate this one here so having, having, having it as 1 minus 1 plus x plus x all over uh, x then into the square root of 1 plus x plus the square root of 1 minus x and this will give us 2x all over x into 1 plus x plus the square root of 1 minus x okay so we cannot eliminate this now now that we've 
now simplify this to the to the uh, uh, simplest term you can now plug in the limit of x as x tends to 0 so here we have 2 1 plus 0 plus 1 minus 0 so here you have 2 the square root of 1 plus the square root of 1 so which will give us 2 1 plus 1 which will give us 2 over 2 which will plus what 1 all right that's the final answer Love what I've just done. Can you subscribe to my YouTube channel and ensure you click on the question button to be notified of all my videos? Thank you and God bless you.